Morning guys. Thursday, October 31st. Little Lucky's up in her house. She's gonna lay down for a little while, take some snooze time, I hope. You'll be a good girl. Got the sun coming up over the horizon. Gonna be a uh, beautiful sunny day. A lot of dew coming down the uh, Get out of here. Quit biting on my leg. Just dripping, dripping off so wet. Windows are all soaked. It's a beautiful day. Lucky wants to fight. You go lay down. You go lay down. Go on. If I kick you in the butt, go on. Go lay down. Go lay down. Go on. Oh, she wants to be a terror. She wants to be a terror chew on my boot. <laughs> Haven't done anything else on the 48. Just still sitting on the trailer. Still sitting on the trailer. So we put two coats of paint on the uh, van truck yesterday. Quit biting me. So the first coat went, uh, I put it on a little bit thick purposely so that it would cling well then the second coat I uh, thinned down just a little bit more so that it would make it all lay flat that's kind of how you have to do it with this type of paint you gotta build and then lay a flattening coat on the top urethane enamel a lot of suicide bugs flew in I counted four suicide bugs these little tiny brown green bugs I didn't try to pick them out once it's dry they're just sitting on the surface so they'll come off but it really I'm not sure I'm trying to get different angles so that you can see how the paint laid out it's got a little bit of orange peel in it but it's the way it is the clear coat's going to take care of that finished uh, going completely over this with the thousand grit I got all the, uh, there was a lot of places like in here where it had heavier orange peel, so I wanted to make sure I cut that all down. Now this is ready for a couple of coats of paint. Not today. I gotta let this sit inside. In fact, I'm not even gonna touch it. I'm just gonna let it sit here. Let the paint cure. Not even gonna take the tape off yet. I brought in uh, every single light that I had. I got them all hooked up. I was able to see though uh, with all these spotlights and I moved them to the other side as I went to the other side I would bring bring a couple more lights over here with me and I've got it all looking pretty damn good man. It's hard to see I'm sure with this camera that's why I'm trying to get the different angles so you can see how it looks probably just making you dizzy moving the camera around so much <laughs> I don't know when I watch the video if I get nauseous I won't post it <laughs> looks good though just gotta let it dry now plug these lights the uh, the thing is with this paint it's not uh, it's not automotive paint like I said it's industrial enamel so I now have to let it just sit here and dry. If I even touch the surface, it'll scratch. You gotta wait. So what I'm gonna do is let it stay in here probably through the weekend. I'm probably gonna rework my tent out back so that I can paint, maybe close the sides in a little bit and I'll be able to get the hood and the tailgate set up for paint. Ugh, it's amazing. This has turned into such a job. Got to figure out still what I'm going to use on the Apache trim. Like I said, I want to make sure I have a... Um, my thought was to just take the... Uh, take this tape, cut the roll in half, and uh, then just use this tape on the back of the Apache with this clean line meeting the clean line on the outside. 
So that's my thought now is to maybe use this. And this stuff is would work. It's going to be sandwiched there. I don't know how though it's... I mean, it's water resistant, so it's not like water's going to affect it. So it might work pretty well. I don't want to use a sponge or something like that. You know what I mean? So putting a little thought into it, and I'll find the right product eventually. But right now, Gorilla Tape's looking good. Out from uh, rest of Rhode Island, guys. You see what's going on here? It's Thursday. Halloween tonight. Don't have much going on. I don't get a lot of kids to come by the house. Being in the back of the property, I don't get any kids, period. Uh, I don't even buy any candy. So, front apartment gets all the action. <laughs> Talk to you later.